Hey guys, this is Vril continuing our Crusader Kings 2 playthrough as Young Griff in the Game of Thrones mod. This is the second time I've tried to record this episode, so I had a crash in the first one, so hopefully we don't have any more crashes. And first I wanted to do some housekeeping here, so we wanted to, as Aubrey recommended in the comments, wanted to grant... Um, the high towers, the reach. It should help me with my vassal limit problem here. I'll still have some issues with it, but that should certainly help. And I do have the Stormlands, so I should think about getting rid of that as well. And if you guys have any comments about who I should give that to, I don't have any close family members I should give it to. I suppose that, I mean, I could give it to Shireen even though she hates me, but uh, maybe you guys have some good comments about that. So let's just continue these wars that we have for um, multiple wars. The most recent one was this Littlefinger one where he wants the uh, De Jure war over Southstone. So I just invited Cersei Lannister to that war, and I was going to call up all of my vassal armies because we had lost the battle there at the end of that last video so let's I'm gonna say don't bother me with any of this and I'm going to do a quick save real quick just because we crashed in the last one and I'm going to end up losing here Cersei can't help me at this time Okay, so what was this important decision here? Ah, uh, we had some more people to put on trial or take them to court, so I'm going to do that later. Okay. King Aegon has inherited the City of Kings landing. Okay, I, I was, that was the other thing I was going to do um, in the housekeeping, but I guess I don't have to do that now. Okay, never mind. This is, uh, I still need to do that because it's the city of King's Landing. What I was going to do was move my capital to King's Landing, so I've done that. And I now need to give this... Can't give any titles to anybody, so... Who are some people that like me? And would be. I don't think we can give Varus much of anything, although. We can give him the city. We can't give him anything else, so maybe we should just give him the city. Although maybe not, I want him to stick around. Who else is out here? Lotho was pretty good. my squire. Walder Frey. I guess that wouldn't be such a bad idea to give that to him. Let's let's just go ahead and do that. Give him the city of King's Landing. Alright, uh, there's some plots. We should be auto turning those off. Lady Marcella, my or Queen Marcella, is pregnant again. My fertility, my sedu seduction focus seems to be helping out with this now. Apparently we're ready to enforce our demands on the North. And Mage of the North is now in jail. Okay. Alright, the war has been won. The rebel armies have been crushed by our brave loyalist, Lady Paramount uh, Mage Mormont. One of the traitors has been brought to you. So I'm going to... don't really dislike her all that much. She just 
didn't really like my rule all that much. So I'll let her bend the knee. Let her bend the knee. So Lord Tyrian, Tyrian of Highgarden refused the revocation of Lordship of Highgarden and requested, requested Lord Paramount Baylor a bright smile. Okay, so he doesn't want to give that away. A lot of plots being cancelled. Thought my army who am I missing here? Would be larger than this. Ah, there's a two thousand stack there. We've got somebody up in Dragonstone. Do I have any ships? Somewhere I do have ships. Ah, here. I knew I had those ships that I've been paying for for years and never put away. So let's get everybody to King's Landing who my leaders of this army is. Randall is really good. Who is this guy? Lord Randall of the Westmarch, okay. Let's go meet up, have these armies meet up. We are not doing that well on these other smaller wars, but we'll take care of these. Kind of waited around and got totally tunnel visioned and didn't take care of these wars as quick as I should have. So one of our one of your jailers has brought war, uh, word from the cells. He says your captive Kristen Brune had, was covertly set free during the night by a small band of men. Incompetent fuel fools. Alright, so this army looks good. Maybe somebody will join me at the time. Check what these. Yeah, my plenty of de jure claims. Yeah, before over the vassal limit. I know everybody's gonna think I'm a tyrant because I'm over the vassal limit, but I don't really have anybody better to give these lands to. All right, Lord Edmund was slain in battle. Who's the... just curious who, are, who is leading these armies for the other opposing side. So... He's been designated as regent to the Iron Throne should the realm need it. I don't even know who the Serpate of the Iron Throne. Who are you? You're just a courtier. He's okay. It's low diplomacy though, so I think I'm going to reject that. There's decent stats otherwise, but... Alright, so we captured Captain Alaris the Wise in battle. Perfect. Okay, they just had just sieged High Heart. Conditions are worsening in South Crack Claw Point. Member of the King's Guard has died. Just checking if that guy had grayscale or something. Okay, let's bring forth. Bring forth people that could be in the King's Guard, and I'll just, uh, this guy seemed pretty good with his martial skills, so I'll have him do it. He's gonna gain 100 prestige. I have another daughter, Neris. 
All right. Well, at least we've got a couple daughters now. Should send one off to be tutored someplace else just in case they try to kill me. Master Ormond. Did we figure out what he did? He wants to kidnap Carl Foster for some reason. He died, uh, his wife died in the Dungeons of the White Walkers. So Master Ormond, he's my... He's... Hand of the King. I think I'm going to have him arrested. I think I could find a better hang, hand of the king. He's been... He's a lunatic. Gregarious. Yeah, I mean, we've had him in some of these trials, and he hasn't been all that great, so let's just uh, arrest him. His intrigue was really low, so I had a 98% chance to do that. Okay, so... I can go after my lover, give her a taste of what they've been missing. Okay, let's continue over to Chiltern Castle, finish sieging this, and we're 57% done with the Baelish, Peter Baelish, uh, Little Finger War here. Jailers seek your audience, and they are all covered in blood when with them they're, they have your captive Lord Lyman Goodbrook in chains. They say a band of armed men secretly broke into the cells and tried to set him free. Let's see what this guy is about. So he's from Goodbrook. It's honorable, lustful. Not too bad. Just put him in the cell. Alright, so we're 100% with Jorah of Wycliffe. Finish off that one. Oh yes, so their Hand of the King. We have Prince Doran of... Dorn? I think that's that's what I'll do. He's infirm right now though, so that probably wouldn't be the best idea. This guy's pretty good with his stewardship too. Can I have this uh, Baylor from the Reach do it? All these guys are lustful. I think I'll do, uh, have a chorus. Get some real or action up in the, uh, up in here. I'm sure he'll be real popular. Probably won't last very long. I was doing him a favor. Alright, we'll siege this real quick. Let's see if He'll bend the knee. Alright. So I do think we're coming up on 15 minutes. I'm going to try to push for these being about 15 minutes long because I've been kept going over. I wanted them to be 20 minutes long and I kept going over that, so... 
One of our jailers has brought word from the cells. He says your captive Lord Lyman Goodbrook was cover covertly set free. I think this guy might have been one of the... Uh, he was already tried to be set free. I thought that was the same name. Might be mistaken. So... Check my diplomatic map here. Just checking where do I need to siege. I guess any of these areas to finish these guys off. Let's head over here to this stack. Word has arrived from Castle Black. Lord Commander writes that the cold winds are rising, the dead are walking. We know all about this, Jon Snow, but we will join you, even though we're not actually joining you. We're saying we are. Okay, here's Baelish's army. No, not Baelish, sorry. Uh, Peter Littlefinger. And there's the anti-piracy war against King Arain of the Stepstones. I think uh, Prince Doran was at war with him before. Let's chase this army over here. Finish them off. They're, we're at 94%. Let's see, what can we do to... Finish this war as quick as possible. Just try to finish sieging this as quick as I can. So I want to finish off so much for that 15 minutes. We're going to finish this thing off. And he just moved to 89%, so I'm not sure what... How we didn't get that there. When introduced to my friend Lotho, I had high hopes. I hoped they would be, uh, become fast friends so we could spend time together, the three of us. When I introduced my friend to Lotho. Okay, so... I think by my friend... Are we talking about my lover? Or... I guess I'm friends with a bunch of people. Get back up to 93%. Stokeworth is getting cold. Whispers are getting cold. So let's siege Harrenhal. Should have done that before. Alright, I think I'm going to stop the video here, and in the next part we will continue sieging Harrenhal. So thank you for watching.